Vagabond Youth, and today I'm going to share with you my dorm closet. Everybody needs love. Now, if you didn't know, I'm actually in my first year of college, and a few months back, I actually showed you guys my entire dorm tour in a video that I'll have linked down below if you want to check that out. But because I had so much to say about how I stored all of my shoes, clothes, and accessories in one dorm closet, I decided to make an entirely separate video. And the reason it's taken me so long to get this video up is actually because my closet is in the darkest part of our dorm. If you can see back there, that is my closet without any lighting. So because it's been difficult just getting ready, even in the mornings, I've decided to add some lighting. Now, a really quick and affordable way you can do this in your dorm room that I found is by adding some Christmas lights. I have added some just basic white Christmas lights that are LED, so it should be safe for your dorm. Are you thinking of me too? invested in some $7 portable lights that you're actually able to stick to the ceiling and they just kind of turn on when you tap them on and off. Alright, so this is the closet I share with my roommate. I actually have two roommates. The one towards the end is my closet. For a treasure worth more than gold. It's been found. Because the dorm closet is a little bit on the smaller side than what I'm used to, and because I have the luxury of going home every weekend if I want to, I kind of just keep all of my basic or essential pieces that I need for this season at the dorms. So what you see here is basically all of my winter or fall clothing, and next season I'll probably switch in all of my clothes for spring clothes. eight years old I've always kind of kept my closet color coordinated and so at college nothing has really changed over here I just kind of start with my pants and then it starts with my most colorful pieces one of my favorite colorful pieces that I have this winter is actually this Prabal Garak sweatshirt that I picked up from Target and then it goes into whites creams grays blacks and then at the end over here I just kind of keep all of my fur pieces like this BB Dakota fur jacket You've probably already noticed, but I don't use any plastic or wooden hangers in my closet. And the reason for that is just basically because I need to get the most space I can out of my closet. And so one thing that I really recommend that you buy before you go off to college this fall is these velvet or felt hangers. And I believe I picked these up at Costco in a bulk quantity of 100. They're just very, very thin. And the great thing about them is that virtually nothing falls off of them because they are made out of this velvet or felt material. But I have to say, out of all of the things that I brought in order to save some space, the best things have been these white hanging cubby. And I picked them up at Ikea, but you can find them at Target or Walmart. So did you guys know that great shoes take you to great places? Well, if you didn't, that's precisely the reason why I have so many shoes in my dorm closet. I think right now I have a total of 20 pairs of shoes. I have around 15 or 16 in here and maybe 3 or 4 or 5 pairs under my desk. I'm not too sure. But when I first started college, the majority of my shoe collection here was actually heels and platforms because as you guys know, I love my heels and platforms. But after being here for a month or so, I started to realize that because my school is in the hills of Los Angeles, there are just way too many staircases and hills for me to climb every single day when I go to class that I've had to kind of switch in all of my heels and platforms for flat shoes. And one of my favorite pairs is actually these ones. They are the All Saints Demisi Combat Boots. I got these as a graduation gift from my parents. So the way that I have it set up right now is a few shoe boxes full of what little platforms I have at my school. And then I have this little makeshift kind of shoe shelf from a plastic bin. And then on the side I just have a ton of my favorite boots that I've been wearing. Another 
another thing that I would really recommend that you buy for your dorm closet or just your dorm in general are command hooks. Now command hooks have saved my life this year and if you can tell over there I actually have two large command hooks holding about 8 to 10 belts and on this wall over here I also have another command hook and it's the mini one and I just have my favorite floppy fedora hanging on the wall so that I can just kind of pop this on and off when I leave for class and over on my desk area I actually have two more large command hooks holding all of my necklaces and collars and I just find that command hooks are super easy and affordable and just a great way to kind of have all of your knickknacks hanging in areas of your dorm room. I'm thinking about you Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today in my dorm closet. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and if you ever need a retweet, you can catch me on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, or anything and I'll have it all linked down below. So be sure to check that out. And I am going to head down to class now so I will see you guys later. Bye! I hope you're thinking of me too.